Meanwhile, a local third grader is giving back to her school, hoping no other child will experience what she went through. Last April, eight-year-old Kaylee Buttry broke her collarbone while at her school's playground. News Channel 9's Jerry Askin caught up with the little girl today to find out what she's been doing to prevent this from happening to someone else. Well, eight-year-old Kaylee is a rising third grader at Hickson Elementary School. She says what happened to her was an accident she hopes never happens to anyone else. Careful, don't get hurt again. On any given day, you're liable to catch eight-year-old Kaylee Buttry doing what she loves to do, playing hopscotch, jump roping, and enjoying time at her school's playground. But last April, she experienced something she'd never want to experience again. Yeah. So which pole was it? I'm not sure it was this one, that one, or that one. She hit her head on one of these red poles while at recess. I was running and I bounced off into a little boy into a metal pole. I hurt my nose and head real bad and I, I broke my collarbone. She was rushed to the hospital and it took her weeks to recover. And after nearly a year of planning. She came to me and another little friend had hurt herself on the playground and she's like, Mommy, I don't know, we've got to do something. I and they've been busy at work since Thursday, patting every pole and sharp object at the playground, hoping this never happens to anyone else. Because I want all the other kids to be safe. We've done three swing sets in a small little playground, um, the hopscotch, as I said, in the little tic-tac-toe area. Helping others is Kaylee's passion. It's her dream to work with kids when she gets older. I want to be a pediatrician to help God take care of all the babies. Her hard work is truly an inspiration for her younger sister. I'm really happy about what she's doing. I'm happy about everybody supporting her and all this. And Kaylee and her family plan to have the entire playground padded before school starts in just a few weeks. I'm Jerry Askin, News Channel 9. Thank you, Jerry. Lowe's and Home Depot and Hickson donated the materials Kaylee and her family needed to pad up that playground.